ஹாய் ஹலோ வணக்கம் அண்ட் வெல்கம் நான் தான் உங்கள் ஆதித்யா பேசுகிறேன் கிரீட்டிங்ஸ் எவ்ரிபடி திஸ் இஸ் ஆதித்யா இஃப் யூ வாட்ச் மை ப்ரீவியஸ் வீடியோ யூ நோ தட் ஐம் கரண்ட்லி இன் டாம் ஸ்டார்ட் ஸோ ஆஸ் ப்ராமிஸ்ட் இயர்ஸ் த பேக்கிங் டூர் ஸோ த ஃபர்ஸ்ட் அண்ட் த ஃபோமோஸ்ட் திங் இஸ் த பேகேஜ் ஹார்ட் கேஸ் சாஃப்ட் கேஸ் ஹார்ட் கேஸ் ஃபார் கேபின் பேக் அண்ட் ஃபைனலி ஒன் பேக் பேக் ஸோ ஐ பி ட்ராவலிங் பை கல் ஃபேர் ஸோ கல் ஃபேர் அலோஸ் தேர்ட்டி டூ கேஜிஸ் இன் திஸ் தேர்ட்டி டூ கேஜிஸ் இன் திஸ் சிக்ஸ் கேஜிஸ் இன் திஸ் அண்ட் This is just a laptop bag, so there is not really any weight specification. Before you buy any sort of luggage, so just decide on an airline and just check their baggage specifications. From what I have seen, uh, these two baggages, the length, breadth and height, the sum of them should not exceed 158 cm or 160. So just make sure you check on the specifications before buying them. Moving on to the kitchen bag. Probably most number of items fall under this category. So the first thing is... Uh, this prestige 2 liter cooker and this is a kadai and this is a dosa tawa and these are for making idli and this is a kettle that can be used for boiling water and you can also make tea with this so that's really helpful and i got some ziploc covers two bottles these are like wipes to clean the kitchen bottle brush hangers two containers for holding cooking oil a plate for eating strainers for making tea and I have got some currandies here or spatula I guess and this is for uh, this is like a peeler and I got some spoons for you know, drinking soup a few forks and a few more spoons a whisker uh, this one is another strainer for like pasta and vegetables this is idiki and these are a few containers for holding rice pulses like that uh, these two lids are they are microwave friendly so we can just store something in them okay, uh, this is a nutri pro blender where we can make juices milk shakes and also chutney with this for cleaning we have this uh, steel scrub this kind of scrub a wim tub and also a rinse soap and grater another small bowl two knives two scissors tumblers dawra small bowls and these are just like small containers to keep sugar tea powder coffee powder stuff like that and these are called clip sealers i guess so once you open any packet and you want to close them you can use this tiffin box from signora ware <laughs> yeah and this box is to hold spices it's called anjari patti in tamil yeah uh, that's pretty much all the kitchen ware you will probably need Moving on to the kitchen portions, we have half kg sugar, half kg AVT tea, two packs of EP noodles, two packs of pasta. This is also an like an instant chai. You just have to mix the uh, powder in 100 ml hot water and some soups. These are also soups like the 10 rupees ones. This is Manna's health mix. This is like porridge or kanji. Uh this perungaya podi as a for tea da powder this is tomato urgai or pickle coriander powder kashmiri chili powder some more chili powder turmeric powder lemon rice powder garam masala leudra powder some dates uh, this one is called as suri powder this is like kashayam so it's like an instant relief when you have cold the ginger garlic paste half liter cold winner cooking oil this kare kudi melagu rasam this is like instant rasam and we have the regular rasam powder tacos uh, sambar powder and a lot of mtr ready mix like multigrain dosa idli uthappam normal dosa masala upma here we have idli chili powder so i am yet to buy a few more items i'll probably buy 1 kg of rice uh, some salt maybe like half kg again and some pulses tor dal moong dal and also rava poha so yeah these are basically the kitchen provisions moving on to a few more miscellaneous items a mini umbrella a scientific calculator 10 ballpoint pens and i'm carrying two notebooks with me some napkins nail cutter brushes toothpaste uh, this is body wash body lotion hand wash dishwashing liquid clips for hanging dresses razors shaving gel a mirror and this is really important this is called as an travel adapter so this is available in amazon this is called type e/f adapters so they look like this this is an electronic trimmer from philips the hair cuts are really costly there so i'll probably have to learn how to cut my hair myself and finally we have a mug and a portable bidet um, this is used in the toilet 
you fill this with water and if you squeeze it water comes out from here and i don't know how well this works i haven't used it so far because obviously why would i use this in india when you have a world class faucet but anyway yeah this is really helpful i guess hey guys it's me from the future and i have been using the bidet for more than 3 weeks now and i got to say it's pretty good i mean you combine that with the mug it's pretty helpful so before sitting down to do your business fill the bidet and also mug keep it near you do your business use both you will be clean all done the next category is electronics so the main thing that falls under electronics are phone and laptop many people do suggest to buy them in germany but personally i prefer to buy them here so that's pretty much it about electronics and the final category are the dresses so i have mostly bought like t-shirts or sweatshirts and pullovers from here i would recommend going to the shop called zudio as fancy as the name sounds i was also very surprised that the there are wide variety of options and they are actually very cheaper so you can buy a lot of clothes from there and i'm just buying one jacket and it's always better to buy winter wear from there as the ones which we buy here they will not really be suited to the climate there so these are basically the items that i'm going to carry now the task is to fit all this into the luggage and make sure that the weight falls you know less than 32 kg and so on and make sure to buy some good quality luggage there are wide variety of options but please do buy some luggage which is of good quality because we all know how airlines handle our packages all right so the packing is done one more thing i forgot to recommend is the usage of vacuum bags so these are available in various sizes but just make sure that the ones you buy fit in your luggage Uh, the ones i bought were slightly larger so i had to fold it before using it these are available in amazon with a vacuum pump and without a vacuum pump so if you have a vacuum cleaner at home you can just buy the ones without a pump so let's look at how we pack things the to start with we have the cabin bag so mainly uh, so i have used a vacuum bag right here so it's better to have like two or three set of dresses in your cabin bag so just in case your check-in bag reaches you late so it's better to have some clothes here and i'm also carrying one set of two set of slippers in fact in this and just a few more dresses you know something in this pouches so yeah and this is quite simple we are uh, moving on to the hard case bag so around 70% of this is just again dresses so here you have one more vacuum bag and actually beneath this i have put all the masalas and the ready made packets in vacuum bag as well so you know it is mentioned that this will reduce 75% of the volume i don't know how true it is but i think it is helpful and hey, even on this side this are just dresses fully one more vacuum bag here so yeah this is the hard case moving on to the soft case so <laughs> this might look all organized looking at this but beneath this you know it is quite uh, half hazard <laughs> uh, i have all the kitchen ware all the kitchen provisions everything so you start thinking like maybe i can organize this properly but once you start packing it's just putting everything everywhere all at once so yeah and you know you uh, most of these soft case baggages these are expandable so it's always advisable to expand them before you start packing and a few more things you know, on this side of the baggage as well so yeah and yeah of course i forgot about this backpack so this is mainly reserved for electronics like laptop bluetooth speaker earphone stuff like that and i'm also carrying my you know the jacket with me here since it is very heavy i didn't want to put them put them here and you can carry some food items here so mainly yeah just mainly put your electronics here like chargers um power banks etc the you should not carry your power banks in the chicken baggages you should always carry them in your backpack so yeah that is pretty much it so yeah a little side note from the future me have a weighing machine at home so that you can keep checking the weight in my case the soft case exceeded the 32 kg so i had to remove some of the stuff out like i removed dry fruits a few ready to eat uh, rice and stuff like that and i would suggest prioritizing your utensils and masalas although they are available here like all the pans you will get it here but they are comparatively expensive so it's better to bring your utensils and masalas from home and once they are over like the masalas you can definitely buy them here or ask your parents to send it via courier 
But yes, other than these two, all the other stuff you can easily get it from all the shops. There are various Indian shops in almost all the cities from what I have heard. So don't worry. <laughs> So yeah, that's it for this video. I have compiled a list of all the items that I have packed and it's in the form of a PDF. So check the link in the description. You can either share this video or the PDF or both to someone for whom this would be helpful. And my next video will be a vlog about my travel from Chennai to Frankfurt and then to Darmstadt. So stay tuned for that. See you in the next video. Nandri Vanakkam.